let's play some more MTG. Um, now let me tell you, this this game is a time killer. I've played like five hours straight yesterday, and I didn't even notice. Um, I went off the computer and was like, "Oh, it's 3 a.m. <laughs> you should better go to bed." But it's so much fun. I like this game so much. It's so great. I want to play a little campaign because I want to unlock new decks. If that's okay, um, I will do custom games later. Um, I got this stampede thing, and I have this guy that I have to defeat to unlock a new deck. I don't really know what he did. I don't remember. Um, we're gonna try to beat him with the pack instinct deck because that is quite easy to play. There's a lot of strong creatures in it, and all of that good. Good jazz. Uh, that looks like a good hand to me. What does that do? Plus one, plus one for each forest. Mm -hmm. That's nice. And that is, yeah, fight. Okay, I'm going to keep that. Mm -hmm. Two, one. Creature. Fork can come in handy if you are about to get your ha ass handed to you because you can uh, prevent all combat damage. Yeah, he'll attack, that's okay. to get used to playing with the with the keyboard. Another land. And get out the what? Oh it can't cost me because three mana. Um <clears throat> Crusade of Audric's power and toughness are each equal to the number of creatures you control. So this one gets 3-3, three, three, I guess. Yep. And that is quite some damage. Out and cast nature's law, and then I can I cannot bring out the brindle ball. That was a mistake. What's this? Squadron hawk, one one flying creature. When Squadron Hawk enters the battlefield, you may search your library for up to three cards named Squadron Hawk. Reveal them, put them into your hand, then shuffle your library. Mm -hmm. And that's the death of me. Well. That went all the way bad, but it's a okay. kind first match of today. I'm just going to pit my deck against his again and see what happens. That doesn't have any land in it. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll keep that. this guy do? What was Battlecry again? Whenever a creature with Battlecry 
uh, attacks. Each other attacking creature gets plus one power for the rest of the turn. This affects all attacking creatures, not just those controlled by the controller or the creature with battle cry. Uh huh. <laughs> Block that. So that's one free damage for him. That's okay. Another squadron hawk out on the field. Nothing that worries me too much. Ooh, that guy's good. Doesn't have any abilities, it's just five, uh, four or five, which is kind of good. Um, bring out another Brindle Ball or bring out this guy? What should I do? I'm bringing out this guy. Still getting used to how turns work and all that. Two damage. I could use that spider with reach. I know it's in my deck somewhere. Pack mm -hmm. leader. You know what, I'm not going to summon another Brindle Ball because I am going to cast... Oh, I can do both. Um, I'm going to cast Primal Bellow. Cast this on one Brindle Ball and then attack with both. That means he can't block anything. Or he can, but this guy will die. And he decides not to, which is what I would have done, I think. But that's 10 damage for me. Sacrifice the Brindle Ball. Hmm? There's the spider I was talking about. Now we're going to bring this little dude in Timbermore Lava, because this one gets plus one plus one for each forest when. Uh, at the beginning of combat, when it attacks. So, if I am not mistaken, I cannot block any of these, so I can cast that, and attack with that. Oh, you can block with the... Uh -huh. 
Oh, this guy dies. Okay. So he can just do one damage now. If he doesn't have a good creature with haste on his hand, he doesn't. And he decides not to because he needs this one for blocking. Um, human soldier, 1-1. One, one. When doomed to travel or dies, put a 1-1 one, one white spirit creature token worth flying onto the battlefield. Mm -hmm. Could use some land. Thank you. Bring in the spider. Or the pack leader. No, bring in the spider because he's dead anyway now. If I am not mistaken. No, I am. Um, I'm going to throw in everything anyway. Just because he has to block and these two guys die. And he takes two damage. Boom. If he attacks with this, I can block with this because this has reach. So he doesn't. Wise choice. Uh -huh. Another one of those. And now I'm bringing in the pack leader. Yep. And I'm attacking with everything I got, and that should be it. I think he's dead. Success! There you go. That went well. Unlocked a card. Yes, I got a new deck. Woohoo!